how to live to 120 and be healthy all the way. Longevity series, part seven, sleep. Hey, I'm Christian Drucker, I'm a stem cell scientist and herbalist. There's one thing that for decades I did not really do well. Like many people, we just think that we can skip a good night's sleep. We can, hey, we're tough enough. We can just like tough it out. And if we don't sleep well, we can catch up the, what, the night after. I mean, I did all my studies literally on caffeine and working overnight shifts. and. Um, and I realize it's probably the thing that has damaged my health the most, if anything. So we know today from studies that if you sleep less than seven hours or more than nine hours, both of them, it, both of them will increase all cause mortality. If you have any sleep every night between seven and nine, that's what is going to reduce the most all cause mortality. So we need to really do whatever we can to have a good night's sleep. And it's not just the amount of time that we sleep, it's also the amount of time that we're in REM, in REM sleep and also in deep sleep. So the tricks here to try to get as much REM sleep and deep sleep is make sure that if you're sensitive to light that you cover your eyes, you know, with some good, good cover so that you're in total darkness. Use ear pods if you want to, to ear, ear plugs to, uh, to block all the noise so that you're totally in silence. You need to prepare or it may work for you. Prepare yourself for sleeping as you get closer to, to sleep time for at least an hour before, uh, don't use any screen, phone, computers, even TV. Try to be away from it. Uh, try to not have caffeine in the day uh, less than, let's say, eight hours before your bedtime. Uh, other things to think about, stop thinking. Try to initiate this, this kind of the, the phase of sleeping. There's one thing that for me has worked super well is super simple. It's these glasses that are basically red glasses that you just wear, uh, you know, an hour or two before you go to bed and it sends a signal to your brain that this is, you know, sunset and your body needs to get ready to go to bed. So these are all tricks to try to get you to get better sleep. If your mind is racing as you go to sleep, just like for once and, and for all, s sit with yourself and think about it. It. Is there anything that you're thinking right now that really is going to help you tomorrow? None of it. There's nothing that you can think about today that will go to help you tomorrow. It will still be there. If tomorrow the problem is not there, great. You don't have the problem anymore. You don't have to worry. Your problem will be there. Just put it aside, go to bed, and then, uh, and then have a